Hi everybody, welcome back to Time Predicts. Today we are doing what are the time to say to you and uh, the exact time and date when they're going to call you and have a few channel messages here. We've got the monology cards here. So let's see what messages you need to know. I am going to do some messages. We'll also do some angel answers, okay? Some answers by the angel, what the angels want you to know. And let's see some messages from them, whatever I can tell you. These are the words they would be saying or these things would be important for you. I wrote, uh, I wrote uh, spoke uh, French, spoke French or I mean no French, I don't know. I wrote these messages at different times. The letters B, N and R are important. B and R. I feeling uh, cold, okay, feeling cold, uh, like, uh, you know, feeling like uh, you feeling that they have kind of distanced themselves, you know, and... Uh, yeah, left out in the cold black color is important for you okay that's another message or maybe you love black color or something to do with black color i got the word marbles you know and uh, normally you know like they say have you lost your marbles this is how you speak or they speak or and silver colors is important maybe you said something like you know uh, the uh, silver lining or something uh, you know in the clouds or some kind of uh, idiom or phrase that you've used with silver this card also came out bat okay you would be noticing a bat um, night person the person either is a night person you're a night person i feel also different time zones uh, when it's night there it's day here i also get 12 p.m maybe um, a message around 12 p.m uh, in the afternoon that's another time i get so 12 p.m and 12 uh, you know after 12 like 12 a.m in the morning both are important so it could be different time zones uh, for the same like you're different in a different place and they are in a different place you were messaging me like crazy so maybe one of you got ghosted because uh, you wanted to reach out and when they did not reply or you were in a fight and when uh, you know you did not reply you went crazy messaging them uh, you know uh, how you get worried and insecure and you know you just message them one after the other and probably you got ghosted because i got the word ghosted here and that is also why we're doing exact uh, date and time of communication or when they're going to talk to you the other letters that are coming out here are k m t O P V L something to do with oval like a shape I'm getting okay I'm getting the word tube like uh, the metro tube whatever you call it like the underground metro forget about the fight so probably you guys fought you're getting a lot of letters and M seems to be there K I think a lot of repeating letters T is supposed to be there I think forget about the fight either you want to say this or they want to say this i think this is you telling them forget about the fight or they telling you forget about the fl uh, fight because uh, one of you will block the other one and i almost said flight so you could be uh, you know going in a plane somewhere so m k a r s t l p your name could begin with this or their name could begin with this forget about the fight so one of you does want to forget about the fight I miss you too, so maybe uh, you guys want to forget about the fight and uh, who's going to reach out first is becoming an issue and uh, you are overreacting. So one of you, two of you, <laughs> both of you in the sense, both of you are overreacting uh, on things, okay? <coughs> Sorry, let's see what are the other messages. What are the angels wanting to say to us? Spread guides, please give me. Though yes, fell on my lap, but let's see. I'm not looking, okay. Okay, two messages here. Let go. Let go of the situation of let go of what's happening, okay. It's very important. I also feel let go of the whole fight, you know. For some of you, let go of, you know, what's happening in a situation and just go with what's happening uh, with the flow. In the near future, so you might get uh, answers in the near future. Trust. Trust the person and the process right now. Trust is required let go could also be you know a lot of times you're like fed up and you want to give up you know you could be in that uh, mood today that i don't want this i don't even want to put things right you know probably you have fed up of some kind of a, a circle or cycle going on with them every time communicate clearly very important that's what uh, i think it's very uh, important to talk to each other <coughs> sorry because i feel there's a lack of communication maybe they didn't respond and you started uh, you know messaging crazy it could be either way because uh, both energies could be there and uh, yeah i think communication will uh, bring a resolution for both of you right now uh, 
you guys could be misunderstanding each other or you know the fight got created because of something misunderstanding and i definitely feel you could have bombarded them with calls or messages or could be the other way around but one of you got ghosted you know it could be temporarily also because a lot of times after a fight people need space you know and you're like let's talk or they're like let's talk and the other person is like uh, you know give me some time otherwise we both will overreact we'll both will fight more so maybe a little bit space is required okay be bold and make the first move like i said or it could be like it says communicate properly when you want to reach out to the other one but don't know who's going to reach out because the ego is coming in you and probably in some of the cases um, you wondering should i you scared to reach out that if i reach out um, even if they've not blocked you if you reach out and they've said okay give me space or you want to talk about the fight maybe they are not ready so you just wondering are you a little scared of the consequences okay so see you would know your relationship the best okay if you want to reach out balance uh, spirituality and uh, practicality so make a practical decision right now make up or take a practical approach in this whole thing if you've not been in touch with them or you got ghosted or there's no contact expect powerful change i saw it in the shuffle right now expect powerful change is beautiful okay something has got eclipsed maybe the whole relationship what has got eclipsed it will clear you know the black um, you know you look at the black spot there it will move and you will see light at the end of the tunnel or it's going to be a new day maybe the maybe you fought at night or something and in the morning you both were like oh god we overreacted now you know what do we do about it who reaches out first so but i definitely feel if you communicate clearly with the other one things are going to be better your commitment is being tested a lot of you are getting tested on commitment have faith in your dreams so whatever you're doing uh, the path is right okay i mean just hold on to the path and things will be sorted you're very close to achieving your goal the path is right you're very close to achieving your goal goal here is your relationship in the sense like uh, whatever you want the outcome will happen okay just think of a positive outcome let us do some just let me keep this away and let us do some uh, exact date and time so you can see it you can take a picture of it okay if you can't see it so ex uh, exact date exact date and time is the first uh, exact date i'm getting is when they will call or when they will be contact or will you uh, when you guys will talk to each other will be may 10th may 19th may 14th 14 may 22nd and may 29th i've given you just may i'll do the june later okay and uh, so uh, whatever's closer and when are you expecting the call so a lot of times you know you're getting hassled when will the person call so these are exact uh, date and time for you guys uh, the time that i get is 9:20 am i get 4:16 pm okay that's an evening time 9:14 am 2:22 pm 10:45 pm at night 11:14 pm at night uh 4 a.m you know i also was going to write 4 a.m 4 p.m it was actually like you know like i said it's night there day there or totally different timings the way you uh, you know what when you sleep you know that totally different time or um, maybe the way uh, you could be working in a different time zone the uh, colors or the messages that i get is blue then a blue color is good for you pink color is good for you um blue candle is good you can uh, burn a blue candle if you want it will bring you peace and blue is for communication you can also do a call me text if you want uh, call me or text me 555 milkshake was coming in my mind i don't know why but there was something to do with the milkshake that was coming up I want to just see. I was not doing the rider weight cards, but uh, they are calling out to me, and maybe there is a message that I need to give to you guys. Spirit guides, please give me a message. But don't overreact, okay? I think you guys should connect when you both are calm. Look at this. When there is a balance, or when you can be a little more practical and uh, you know think from the heart and the. use your mind because right now overreacting could be that uh, you know you would just be overreacting in a fight and you both will um, you know continue fighting if you don't give each other space and time so both of you for both of you 
you know i think it's it's a little uh, it's it's better if you guys <laughs> take time and uh, you know then talk to each other but it seems like a protected uh, energy you know angels are protecting uh, the relationship and you've got knight of wands coming back or approaching you with a lot of passion and compassion i get both the words you know and uh, you've got uh, the journey card here so one after the oh look at this one after the other let's see, see these four cards so you've got the journey card you've got the love you know approaching the whole situation with love and that's how they're going to approach or you should approach it with love not with you know fighting because i feel the fight is not like really um uh, you know major issue i mean it's like when it starts small and very little things then they become a big big fight okay so there is love there's ace of cups you could be dealing with a water sign you could be a water sign coming towards you next six days next six days are important somebody's making that journey making that effort it's either you or them so within 6 days i definitely feel there's going to be a talk you know but i feel because there is a woman and a child there you know what i feel with this card is that uh, addressing the issues i mean uh, they're bringing the issues along so they would want to talk about it if you also want to talk about the issues or problems between you two i feel approach it with love you know that's another thing that i get a very balanced uh, have a very balanced talk don't just start fighting and it's for them also okay and uh, if if you start the uh, talk with uh, like a wrong tone i'm not saying who's wrong and right because i feel it was a very silly or a small fight okay which really uh, became extremely huge so they are going to uh, you know definitely they have passion and there is uh, empathy in their heart and they feel for you and they want to make it work and they want to come towards you and uh, i they will come towards you because it's not that this relationship is over or you know not going to talk so it's just when okay when and what time and uh, the balance is supposed to be restored will be restored i feel a very calm and be careful you know how the you know angel is actually balancing one foot on land and one on water so this requires being sensitive okay being sensitive to each other okay and uh, definitely balance is going to be restored both if if you see both you know the message is the same from the spirit guides to me that love should flow in the situation in the sense deal it with love not like you know uh, being rude to each other or just be gentle with each other you know the approach has to be very gentle and to communicate properly and to start talking so the fight gets over spirit guides please give me five signs please give me five signs could be your sign or their sign if it's not there don't worry guys you've got a taurus you've got pisces we had pisces anywhere in the monology card and if you can see uh, not in this one the fish are there you know after each other like in the sense swimming in perfect harmony you've got scorpio a lot of blue like i see you know today is like all blue so this is 3 you've got leo yeah don't like roar on each other like a lion or lioness or whatever gender just be gentle cancer you got you both are emotional about each other be balanced don't get over emotional okay and i definitely feel things will be right for you guys let's see any messages from the cauldron spirit guys any one message you want to share <laughs> you got flowers flowers also when you you know when you hold them you got to be gentle so flowers is beautiful expect flowers expect a sorry and flowers so this is beautiful might be a sign for you for something okay let's see even this is there wow fated connection all blue all blue i had flowers here i think i've kept it back yeah so flowers and faded connection all blue and blue is a beautiful color of communication and this is so beautiful and you can see blue here also everywhere <laughs> so take care guys and have a beautiful day i'll be back with another reading do join my spell class it's on saturday 1 hour 15 minutes very affordable you will love it and there are four spells so take care guys do write to me if you want a personal reading or you want to join my class spell class bye guys have a good day